Okay, here we have a preliminary demo using three different uh, signals simultaneously, starting with the same file source we had before. This is a pre-modulated data and then it's being converted to float and modulated and scaled. And then three different frequency shifts are applied, zero and plus or minus 12.5 kilohertz, which is the nominal frequency spacing for M17. And then they're added together and resampled and transmitted by the Pluto. And here we see this is just a single one of the signals being modeled, but here's all three of them added together. So signal, signal, signal. And let's look at on the receiver. On the web receiver, here's the three signals. And if I pick one of them. Could you just sense his breath, his scrutiny, his breath? Pick another. Here I am, pick, said Mrs. Bella. The transition seamlessly because they're completely synchronized. But we have three different signals transmitting the same thing. Now let's try a version that has three different signals. Okay, here's a modified flow graph. Now we have three different files being played out, and they're all going through this parallel construction here. Short to float, frequency modulator, scaling, and then the three different frequency shifts being added up resampled and transmitted. So let's run it. There it is. This is, we're still looking at only one of the signals here. And again, here's the three signals. You can't tell that they're different, but they are. Now let's go receive them. Notice here we've picked up the new transmitter. So let's pick the center one. I'll pick the plus 12.5. And the minus 12.5. So now we're really transmitting three separate M17 signals and receiving them distinctly all over the same uh, SDR uplink. The class had been in session for almost 15 minutes.